Hello, you are on InstaForex TV channel where you can learn about the latest financial market news. I'm Kate Stichina. The stock market decline has wind down oil prices. The hammering stock market reminded the markets of the global economic instability, which sparked growing fears that the demand for energy will be unchanged in the long term. The short term outlook is also unfavorable for crude oil, as this trading instrument is considered a risky asset, while traders now prefer safe ones. Thus, during the third consecutive day of the fall in oil prices, the price for North Sea brand crude fell below $76 per barrel. The recent information that OPEC members produced peak volumes of oil contributed to the concerns. The United States is also boosting its oil production, which is confirmed by the continuing increase in the country's crude oil reserves. Yesterday, the Energy Information Administration reported a 6.346 million barrel draw in crude oil stockpiles, which is twice as much as the expected volume. And this is the fifth straight week of increases in the US oil inventories. The WTI price after that reminded at the two months low of $66 per barrel. At the same time, commodity sensitive currencies retain their advantage despite the dynamics of oil prices. Traders turned to buy in the Canadian dollar after yesterday's decision of the Bank of Canada to raise interest rates. The price chart is near 1.3020. Meanwhile, the Russian ruble is keeping afloat as the tax uh, filling season is in full swing in the country and also amid yesterday's statement by US National Security Advisor John Bolton that Washington is not considering new sanctions against Russia. The currency's price remains below 65.70. You were watching Market News on InstaForex TV channel with me, Kate Tikhina. We wish you profitable deals with InstaForex.